Hi, I'm Fiona, author of 25 Foods Kids Hate and How to Get Them Eating 24 and welcome to my Video Jug Cooking for Kids series. And this is one of my most talked about recipes, one of my most popular as well, avocado ice cream. I know it sounds a bit strange, but trust me, it tastes so good. And best of all, you don't need an ice cream maker to make it. So there aren't many ingredients to this recipe. First of all, cream. The full ingredients and all the details are in the description box. And we're going to whip up this cream until it's thick. I'm using a, uh, a proper food processor here, but you can use a handheld whisk if you want to, or do it by hand. In it goes. Okay, so it's been about three minutes and it's nice and thick. I'm going to just pour through the sugar and then go again for another minute or so. Okay, so we're done and let me show you the consistency that we're looking for. It's really nice and thick now. So I have three flesh of avocado over here. I'm going to show you how to prepare an avocado for my fourth avocado because some people find it a little bit tricky. Hold it firm on a chopping board and then slice it lengthways all the way around. Okay, the big reveal. I love that colour. Um, and then literally use a teaspoon or a big spoon if they're bigger avocados, obviously, just to scoop out the flesh. So the avocados do go brown very, very quickly and lose their colour. And the way to deal with this is to give them a little bit of a sprinkling of fresh lime juice or lemon juice. So I have now got four avocado. I'm going to place them into my other amazing machine, my uh, food processor. There's one, there's three more, juice of two limes, this is like a real flavour of Mexico for kids. And we're going to whiz this up until very smooth. I think that's about the smooth consistency that I'm looking for and we have got loads of recipes on our Video Jug YouTube channel that you can subscribe to for free uh, with loads more ideas as to how you can get super creative with your veg and your fruit. We'd love to hear your comments too. Join us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter at Video Jug Food. For now though, I have got my cream and sugar mix which I'm going to pour into my freezable ice cream bowl. This is kind of healthy, but it's kind of decadent too. The avocado makes it healthy and the cream makes it decadent, but it tastes good. There we go. And I'm going to add the avocado mix. And it goes. And if you know anyone that doesn't tend to eat ice cream because of an egg allergy, then again, this is perfect no egg ice cream and because I'm feeling a little bit extra decadent I'm actually going to grate in some chocolate as well but this is entirely optional there we go use as much or as little as you want and then you literally combine it all together There we go, that's nicely combined. Then all you do is put it in the freezer for three to four hours. You can leave it in there for longer or overnight. That's fine, but take it out for maybe an hour or so, just or half an hour or so, just to soften through a little bit for that soft scoop effect. But this will go down a treat. And here, as they say, is one that I made earlier. And I want to show you a really good tip as to how to serve these a little bit posh. I have 
got here uh, some waffle cones and I've dipped them in some melted white chocolate, sprinkled them with some sugar sprinkles and then left them to dry on greaseproof paper for half an hour to an hour. And I think they look really cute. So here we go, the moment of truth. Using my ice cream scoop, and I think, again, the colours work really well. One more. Why not? And one more again. Right, there we have it. My avocado ice cream. Really hope you enjoyed this one. Please do try it out on your kids and maybe your friends as well. So that's it from me. I really hope you've enjoyed my video jug cooking for kids series and I certainly hope I've inspired you to get creative with veg when cooking for your kids. Mm -hmm.